HMCS Regina and Motor Vessel Astics have also come from the North Arabian Sea and the Indian Ocean, uh, Arabian Gulf. Uh, we were able to take a rest and maintenance period in Dubai and then immediately from Dubai redeploy from that region, uh, Middle East, and through the Indian Ocean, all the way to the Indian Ocean, through the Malacca Strait, Singapore, and, and then into the South China Sea for part of op projection. Uh, and as op projection uh, has different uh, priorities in this region, we were able to participate in those and part of those priorities and diplomatic efforts, and Vietnam was the first part of that. Great reception by the Vietnamese People's Navy. We were able to uh, enjoy uh, a nice dinner and really uh, get to know what they were about. And uh, we were able to host them uh, the following evening for a reception on board the HMCS Regina. Really good to see such a large turnout. It's actually a very remote location in Cameron. Uh, people came from Hanoi, people came from Ho Chi Minh, people came from all over the provinces. So it really generated a lot of interest. People wanted to make sure they were part of the Canadian reception. Uh, and we were able to, uh, you know, give, give uh, back to the Vietnamese in terms of the reception that they gave us. Uh, so the ambassador, of course, attended and hosted that reception, and so that was good to see uh, all the diplomatic efforts tying in with our defense effort in that region. When we were in Vietnam, I had the opportunity to go visit an orphanage uh, just outside of Nha Trang, uh, and we got to hang out with some of the orphans, we did some coloring with them. Played soccer, we helped them paint the sculptures. Uh, it was a really great time getting to hang out with the kids, but it was a really awesome experience and it was really nice to see how well taken care of they were by the nuns that ran the orphanage uh, and how clean um, and safe it seemed over there. We were able to present a check $10,000 that was given to us, raised by Boomer's Legacy funds and Boomer's Legacy about troops supporting others. Uh, and it's really meaningful for us to give them $10,000, which will be used for a road project uh, such that uh, when it does flood in the region, uh, that people don't have to walk through uh, dirty water uh, and kids uh, from out in the region that need to get to the orphanage actually can get there without uh, worrying about their feet and, and diseases, etc. Uh, and so some really some goodwill, some outreach, on behalf of Canada was done by sailors uh, wearing, the, uh, wearing the uniform. And I think our sailors and airmen and, and uh, people that participated really got a lot out of it.